Archaeopteryx was certainly no acrobat, but it had feathers, and it could fly. Its collarbones had already fused together, a vital step enabling the wings to flap efficiently and gain altitude, allowing it to hunt and nest in trees. Throughout the 20th and 21st centuries, more Archaeopteryx fossils were unearthed in Germany. The feathers on its feet are intriguing, since modern birds no longer show this characteristic. Is this an exception? What is sure is that this feature has not been selected by evolution. Just like this giant marine reptile, a Leoplorodon. Washed up on the shores of the lagoon, it is a godsend for Archaeopteryx. The flies attracted by the carcass provide a hearty meal for this insect eater. Being out in the open is dangerous for Archaeopteryx. An opportunistic Germanodactylus sees the prospect of a protein-rich meal. And doesn't appreciate the competition. creatures in the strands. Pterosaurs became extinct by the end of the Cretaceous period, 65 million years ago, while Archaeopteryx's descendants grew in number. Bogged down at the bottom of the Sonhofen Lagoon, this remarkable fossil launched the debate on the relationship between birds and dinosaurs. But with insufficient proof, this theory was shelved for more than a hundred years.